Hello everyone. Today let's see how easy it is to create a powerful business application using Microsoft Power Apps. So here's the requirement. We have a list of courses stored in this Excel file. The details which we maintain are course ID, course name, duration, the number of credits and whether it is a mandatory course or not. So the requirement is people who work on maintaining this list of courses in a university or in a school should be able to easily perform the CRUD operations on top of this data for being able to insert, update, delete, view information in a first class device such as tablet or phone or even desktop application. So there are different ways to achieve this. You can share the link to this Excel sheet via an email or you can ask users to perform the CRUD operations or the ideal or the smartest way of doing this is basically create a, an application which can be rendered on a mobile or a tablet or a browser which provides a nice user experience for users to provide the uh, or users to perform the required uh, CRUD operation. So let's close this screen and let's go to make.powerapps.com and I'll go to uh, start with when you go to apps you'll see different options and let's go to create option here and there's option called uh, blank app and dataverse so there's option to connect with sharepoint list and then there's option to connect with excel so let me select an option to connect with excel and then it will uh, provide what are the existing connections i have so i have already worked with sharepoint connecting with sharepoint and onedrive and uh, if you have not done this before so you can go to new connections and i talked about connections in one of my previous videos i'll put a link to that video in the description so there are various connections uh, uh, under this connection list uh, so you can pick the required connection to connect with the data source so currently my excel file is in onedrive so i already have a connection set up for onedrive uh, if not you can easily go to new connection option here there is option called onedrive for business and then you can uh, go through this connection creation process so let me select this existing connection and then you will see the course catalog as um, an excel file here as an option and then when you select the excel file it will go through uh, and uh, list the existing tables so i do have a table called courses so let me pick that and then say connect so now it creates a, a three page application for me without uh, uh, having to write a single line of code so the three pages are basically being able to view and to insert and to update the existing records so let's uh, give it a couple of seconds and then uh, uh, in, in few seconds you will see a, a nice uh, uh, a look and feel uh, coming up uh, in the power app screen so the idea of uh, this particular video is uh, to show you how fast and how easy it is to create a, a business application with power apps without writing a single line of code so let's click the skip option and now I, ha I have a, a, a power apps already created so this is basically um, the, the the end result outcome so you'll see um, so under the I'm under the screen section uh, so you'll see there are three screens as I uh, uh, explained earlier so there's a browse screen there's a detail screen and there's edit screen so these are the three screen it has generated for me and if you go through each and every screen uh, has bunch of controls in it uh, I'm planning to talk about uh, some of these controls in detail and also how to create a custom control uh, uh, in a future video uh, stay tuned for that uh, and then um, so if, if you want you can also uh, customize this look and feel very easily um, and 
customizing the uh, look and feel i will leave it for another day uh, but just to prove the point uh, uh, i'll change uh, the text over here so you'll see uh, you get the cursor um, so you can say courses app um, and let me run the application here uh, you'll see it's in the D in the uh, list uh, view right now so you can search uh, for a course if you have uh, more than 20 30 courses listed over here this search will come really handy uh, and if you want to go for a detailed view um, let's go to uh, uh, the first report and then it will take you to the detailed view uh, and if you want you can delete this or if you want to make any modifications uh, so let's increase the duration to uh, 30 hours um, save it um, and you see it's being saved uh, you go back so it's uh, updated to 30 and if you want to create a new course it will give you the new uh, screen so let's say five course name is uh, power of power apps uh, duration I don't think we need more than five hours to co complete everything around power up it's so easy to learn number of credits keep it as five no it is not mandatory and say save so it's saving the new record to the list so you have the fifth record here um, so that's it right so let me close this um, and now what you can do is you can save this power app and publish it so that others can use it right um, so let me also go back to my uh, excel sheet uh, open it again uh, so you see the, the only difference is right now uh, it has added the new record the fifth one I just added and also it has in introduced a new column that is the way to link this uh, excel sheet with my business application power app application uh, yeah that's all so if you if you cut the uh, you know crap of me explaining the business value and this and that and the number of screens being generated and all of that i believe uh, less than you know two minutes you should be able to create a full crud uh, uh, enabled uh, business application uh, using uh, uh, power apps thank you